Hey everyone, welcome back to Effect for You channel. Today, we are going to create retro style title animation like this. So let's get started. First, create your composition. 1920 by 1080, this is our main comp. Then create solid layer. Select the layer and search fill effect. And change fill color dark blue color, but you can add any other dark color. Now create one more new solid layer, width and height around 2000 pixels. Select the layer and search fill effect. This time change fill color with little bit different dark color. Then search Venetian blinds effects. Increase transition completion around 50%. Here you can see. Also increase the width around 150. Now search polar coordinates effects. Change type of conversion, rect to polar. And increase the interpolation 100%. Cool. As you can see here our Venetian blinds width not adjust perfectly, so adjust the width little bit. Perfect. Also increase the layer size little bit. Now we need to animate the Venetian blinds effect. So go to first frame, and add a keyframe on transition completion, and change the transition completion 0%, then go to 1 second forward, and change amount 50%. Now we need to add expression on rotation. So hit R for rotation. Hold Alt key and click on stopwatch icon. And type time into 50. Here you can see the effects. Cool. Now go to project window. Here I have half tone effect image. So drag the image into the timeline. Change mode normal to overlay. You can adjust the fill color according to your choice. Cool. Now go to project window and create new comp. This is our text placeholder comp. Select text tool and type your text. Now we need to animate this, so open text layer, go to animate and select, position, scale, rotation, and opacity. Change Y position 10, rotation 13 degrees, Scale 0% And Opacity also 0% Now select Animate to 1 and add Expression Selector Open Expression Selector Here we need to add some expression, so copy Delay Expression Hold Alt key and click on Stopwatch icon And paste it here Cool. Now duplicate the text layer and change your text. Perfect. Now go to main comp, and create a new composition. This is our text pre-comp 1. Now drag the text placeholder 1 comp in text pre comp 1 composition. 
Now go to main comp, and drag text pre-comp 1 into the timeline. Select the layer and search fill effect, and change your color. Now duplicate the text pre-comp layer. Select the bottom layer, and change the fill color with dark color. Then search CC Radial Blur effect. Change type of blur, fading zoom. And increase the amount around 10. Now search levels effects. Select alpha channel. And move your histogram all the way to black side. Here you can see how it looks. Cool. Now we need to adjust the CC radial blur center point. So that you can adjust the direction of the shadow. Cool. You can adjust the center point according to your choice. You can also adjust the blur amount. Perfect, it's look good to me. Now we need to create one more text on top side, so select the pen tool, and create a shape like this. Now select the shape layer, and apply fill effect. And change the fill color. Now we need to animate shape layer. Select the layer hit S for scale, go to first frame and add a keyframe, unlink the scale amount, and change X scale amount 0%. Then go to around 20 frame forward, and change the X scale 100%. Select both keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Cool. Now go to project window and create a new composition. I call this top text comp. And decrease the width and height. Select text tool and type your text. I think we need to increase the comp height little bit. Perfect. Now go to main comp and drag the top text comp into the timer line and adjust the text center of the shape layer now select top text layer and search fill effects and change your color now we need to create a mask on it so duplicate the shape layer and move above the text layer then select text layer and change track mat alpha mat. Here you can see. Cool. Now select all text and shape layers and move around 10 frame forward. Perfect, it's look good to me. Now we need to add bottom text here. Go to project window, and create a new composition. I call this bottom text 1, you can change the dimension according to your choice. Select text tool and type your text. Now we need to add the same animation and same expression, which we have apply in our main text, so I am moving this part little fast forward, so that you don't have to wait. Cool. Now go to main comp and drag bottom text comp into the timer line. And move the layer 10 frame forward, and move the text bottom side of the comp. Cool. Now drag the light leak footage into the timer line. Change mode normal to screen. And decrease the opacity around 70%. Now drag the micro dirt footage into the timer line. And change mode normal to screen, and change opacity around 70%. P 
perfect, it's look good to me. Select all layers and pre-compose them. This is our scene 1 comp. Now we need to add scene 2, so go to few second forward, and duplicate the scene 1, and move forward, then go to project window and duplicate scene 1 comp. Hold alt key and drag the scene 2 comp into the timeline. Open scene 2 comp. Now we need to replace our text also, so go to project window, and duplicate the text pre-comp 1, then hold alt key and drag text pre-comp 2 into the timeline, open pre-comp 2, and also replace the text placeholder 1 comp. Open text placeholder 2 comp and change your text. Cool. Similarly, you can replace the both text also, I am leaving this part so that you don't have to wait. Perfect. Our animation has done. Hit 0 for ender. Thanks for watching, I hope you like the video, so please, like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel. For more tutorial I'll see you in the next video.